my name is Lori and I'm going to show you how to make three really cool food challenges for your dog for Halloween. Okay, and finally, to make the little snake for Halloween for your dog, this food challenge is probably my favorite one. All you need again are some of your dog's favorite treats cut up. Um, I've got some felt here that is in the shape of two little eyes and a snake mouth. <laughs> again, that's optional. I don't know that my dogs even care about the face. That's more for us. Um, and then I've got some really thick um, ladies knee-high socks. And then I've just got this little round, it's like a little ball with a squeaker inside of it that's really good for the head of the snake. If you don't have something like this at home, then what you can do is take a squeaky and a little washcloth and just wrap the squeaky in the washcloth and you'll get a very similar shape for the head of the snake. So all you do is you take one of the, of the socks and whether you're using this one or this one, put it inside to the very end. The end of the sock to make the head. And then take this one and put it inside of the other sock. And also put it to the end. This will make the toy a little bit stronger. Okay, So that'll be the head of our snake right there. And all you need to do next is then make a tie. Tie the head off. Decide which side you want to be the top of the head so that it's the smoother side. Okay. Once you've got that part, then you take a pair of scissors and cut the outside sock only, not the inside sock, the outside sock only all the way up to the top. and then on the other side as well. Just the outside sock. This is so cheap. These socks cost me 99 cents and I'm gonna have an awesome food challenge for my dog. Okay, so I've got three strands now. So I'm going to very loosely braid the strands. And the reason you wanna loosely braid them is because we're going to be hiding some food in there for the dogs. So that's where the food challenge comes in and also because you don't want the body of your snake to be too skinny. So we're going to loosely braid the remainder. And then once you get towards the end, the two skinnier sides, the ones that we cut, I just tie it in a knot. So there's one tie and another tie to make the end of the snake. Okay, and then if you want to, you can add, like we did the last time, eyes and a little um, tongue on him. Just sew those on with a needle and thread. I hate sewing, so you're not going to see me do it. But if you're crafty and you like to sew, then that would be a great finish to your toy. It can be creative. Don't use googly eyes because you don't want your dog to accidentally swallow those. That's why we sew these right on if you're going to have them on your toy because you don't want your dog to actually accidentally eat those. And then here comes the fun part. So for this one, you take little bits of food and you hide them throughout the braid. And this way, your dog has a challenge that's going to keep him busy for a little while. Put them all the way through on both sides, all down the snake trail. I'm going to hide it in the folds a little bit. And you can hide them in the neck too. In fact, for the other challenges, um, to get your dog interested in sniffing around the neck of the pumpkin, you can also hide a few treats in there. Because you want him to be in, interested in this tie to get the tie off. Because then he'll get to the other treats without ruining your little towel. And like a lot of games, you should be interacting with your dog. We'll do that again for this for the ghost as well. Take his eyes off for now. Um, it's really great if you can supervise your dog and, and play with them and help him out. And you know, if you show him 
how we can get into the challenge without get into the toy without wrecking the towel, then you can use this again and again as an interactive toy. Okay, so those are our three little Halloween challenges, um, which don't look much like challenges because I don't have the eyes and the faces on them. But you'll get to see Tango and Sparky trying to get to the treats inside of these, these food challenges for Halloween. Happy playing!